Next, we're going to look at wheat. Um, here you can see our historical marketing year average prices from 2013 through 2017. Um, then we have the 2018, and then the projection prices. And what you can see here is the last several years, wheat prices at the marketing year average have been, all been below that reference price. So again, you can quickly see it's very likely having that red reference price as your um, PLC guarantee is going to be a good deal. Um, and so that's the short answer. What's, what should I do if I have wheat base acres in the state of Wisconsin? Sign up for PLC. With these price expectations, that, that 550 um, reference price is a very good option. Um, ArcCO, again, is going to be locked into these historical um, lower um, average yields, and so it's not going to have as high guarantees. PLC is clearly the better option. Um, he runs the simulations, but again, it's gonna, you can run this for your county if you want and your base acres, um, your payment yields, and your price expectations. But here's an example for Kiwani County with 50 bushel per acre um, payment yield. You can see very strongly that PLC is the option. Again, you run different counties, you'll get different answers in terms of the uh, payments depending on your payment yields. And ARC will change a little bit for across counties, but in general, you can see this across all our counties. With that reference price of 550, PLC is a very good option. Last, we're going to look at oats. Um, these are the historical prices, again, and then the USDA projections for 2019 and 2020. And what you can see here is our expectations are above that 240 reference price. Um, they've been below it the market price over the last couple of years uh, back in 2015 and 16, but in general, this looks pretty good. Um, the relative to that um, price, the market price has been above it. And so the short answer for oat base acres, there's not a lot of them and they're not high paying acres. There's not even a simulation tool for this one because it's nationally it's not a most important enough crop. Um, but the short answer is to sign up for ARC. Um, the reference prices are below our expectations for market prices. The, our historical prices over the last several years have given us a very good price guarantee in ARC of 273 for 2019. It'll still remain high for 2020. And so it's much more likely to trigger um, payments um, under the ARC program with low yields than it would be if you under the PLC falling below that reference price at 240. But again, I emphasize neither program is likely to pay a lot. Um, it's just oats doesn't have a large payout relative to our other crops. So in quick summary here, corn, sign up for PLC, soybeans, run the um, Gardner um, simulation model and find out what works best for each of your FSA farms based off your payment yields in the county you're in. Wheat, I recommend PLC. Oats, I recommend ARC at the county level.